everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Kristen and welcome to my channel. So today guys, we're actually doing a create a sim based on the Disney cartoon of Pocahontas. Now, this is definitely not to be confused with the real life story of Pocahontas and this is just completely based on the actual Disney cartoon. Now, I will make sure to also leave the link for where I got Pocahontas' dress and her tattoo as well as John Smith's full outfit. So it's actually not in English. It took me honestly like a week to actually find the CC to do this create a sim, but I will make sure to leave a link in case maybe you guys want to download this household and add on their outfits or even make your own. So as soon as I heard that we were able to have raccoons in the game, this is the first thing that came to my mind. When I was younger, this is definitely my all time favorite Disney character. I've just always loved the story of Pocahontas. I loved her character and I feel like she's just so like such a strong personality of a character. I've just always loved her. I had so many different Barbies that I used to play with with her when I was younger and I always just wish that I looked like her. Um, I think she's so beautiful. So it is sometimes a little bit harder to actually make creative sims based on cartoon characters because sometimes they're like facial features. It's a little bit hard to duplicate them. But I definitely had a lot of fun and it really made it easier with the CC because there's no way that I would have been able to make her with her very distinctive kind of like her dress and the blue necklace which I always wanted to have one of those when I was younger too. So then we actually have Miko. Now I kind of struggled a little bit to get him to look the way I wanted because in the movie he has like this chubby little body but then his hands are like super super skinny so um they weren't as skinny as i would have liked them to be but i did go ahead add on his like black gloves and his stripes on his tail and then like painted over his face to really make it look exactly like him or the best that i could get so i think he turned out really good i think he looks almost identical to Miko in the cartoon and I had a lot of fun with him and like choosing his traits that were very specific to him a little bit of a troublemaker a little bit glutton <laughs> really loves his food and then I also went ahead and like gave Pocahontas her traits I picture her to be like loves the outdoors she's a friend of all the animals and everything like that so another thing that I really enjoyed about the movie was all of the songs I felt that they were not as like uppity princessy as you would see in like Cinderella and Beauty and the Beast. I just really loved like the colors of the wind and all of those songs. I think that's like one of my favorite things in the movie and the tree with like that older, I think she's like an older woman <laughs> that plays the tree. I love that one, the willow tree. So then John Smith actually has a bunch of CC. So it comes with like the shirt, the pants, the boots, the hair, and um, the hair is a little bit more clayified but it's definitely the distinctive shape and cut of John Smith. So I was thinking about doing Kokum, but I just kind of decided against it, but his CC is also gonna be in the file. If you guys download it and you actually wanna create him as well, I loved him in the movie too. I was like so sad when he died. <laughs> oh my gosh, it was horrible. So I definitely struggled when I was creating Percy. Now Percy in the movie has this like really, um, I don't even know what you would say like this fan shaped collar or something like because he is like a fancy dog Percy dog so I kind of had to make my best impression of him using like the collar that we have um like one of the blue collars and tried to like really create his face to look like the same he was probably the hardest one to create and he also has these eyebrows but I felt like when I put them on him it looked like a bad paint job so I just kind of decided against it had a lot of fun choosing his traits also but definitely give this video a very big thumbs up if you guys did enjoy and also let me know down in the comments what other cartoon characters that has dogs in it or cats or animals would you guys like to see me recreate and hopefully I'm gonna see you guys in my next video bye guys